Amazon had planned to build an airport cargo center, hire a thousand workers, and invest hundreds of millions of dollars over 20 years at Newark Airport in New Jersey. But advocacy groups and unions involved said they could not support the lease unless Amazon made a set of concessions that included labor agreements and a zero emissions benchmark. So Amazon pulled out of that. Two other companies bid on the project. MetaQuest headsets will finally stop requiring a Facebook account. Users will still need a Meta account, and that will start rolling out next month. Meta account creation requires lots of personal information, including your name, email address, phone number, date of birth, and payment details for buying apps. Well, Walmart is making its in-home delivery service available to Walmart Plus subscribers for an extra $7 per month or $40 per year. The service brings groceries and other goods from your local Walmart inside your home and inside the refrigerator. The monthly cost does not count the added fees, though, associated with purchasing a compatible $50 level smart lock and then a Genie automatic garage door opener or garage keypad that will give them access to your home. And Apple is reportedly back in on Big Ten talks after USC and UCLA said they would join the conference. Apple TV Plus has been developing its sports portfolio, which includes a package of Friday Major League Baseball games and 10-year streaming deal with MLS. Sports Business Journal reports that media rights for the Big Ten's next deal are already mostly divvied up, but there are still some games available. From the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King with your tech report.